good people once again it's Gigi and today I'm back with the Universal Yums box I this this was most definitely the January box <laughs> and I don't know why I haven't done it yet it actually took me a couple of weeks to go pick it up I don't know why but anyways I'm back okay like I would say it's the yum yum box so it has 12 or more snacks um, 12 12 plus snacks, so it's normally like 12 to 15 snacks. Um, and January's box was the land with the largest castle, which is Poland. Huh, alrighty. Um, I'm thinking about doing what I always do, which is I like to get like all the, um, oh my gosh. <laughs> I like to get all the like salty snacks out of the way because I like to save the last part which is always the sugar. Um, so, there we go. This is the box. And let me see. That's sugar. So, oh, oh my gosh. Wow, well, guys. I'm clumsy today. Um, that's definitely chocolate. Okay. All right. So, we're, we have four non sweet things in the bag. Um, I'm going to try these Monster Munch things only so they look cool. Um, let's go ahead and look at what those are. Salted Potato Snack. So, with it being from a different country, it makes me wonder if it's going to be salty, salty. But it doesn't smell too bad. Let me see. That's <laughs> oh. Oh my gosh. That's good. I could eat that. That is really good. Um, next one I think I want to try. Crackers with black cumin and onion. I feel like this one might have a strong taste. It kind of does has a little bit of a strong taste, but I feel like some cream cheese would really make it taste better. Yeah. Well, that Monster Munch was on point. Um. Oh, this one scares me. This one right here, which is pretzel sticks with poppy seeds. <laughs> This really scares me. Oh my, my goodness. Oops. Oh my gosh. It fell in the garbage. <laughs> Wasn't expecting that. <laughs> okay. The aftertaste is better than the first taste that's not i'm not a fan anyway paprika potato sticks hmm these are little little thingamajiggies over dinner tables throughout the u.s You'll hear requests to pass the salt and pepper, but in Poland you'll hear something different. Pass the paprika. That's actually good. Yeah. Ooh, it's used to add flavor and color to beef, fish, eggs, cream cheese, veggies, stews, salads, and of course potato sticks. Okay. Anyway. Now on to the sugar look oh my gosh look at this like why oh my gosh all this is just sugar alrighty hmm I don't know what I want to try first they all have chocolate darklet darklet <laughs> I can't talk guys <laughs> um 
Dark chocolate covered vanilla marshmallow. Ooh, okay. This could either be really, really good or really bad because it's chocolate, hard chocolate, squishy marshmallow on the inside. But it smells and looks good, so. Hmm. Like I said, it's kind of interesting. Because it almost doesn't taste like a marshmallow texture, even. It tastes like just a weird gummy feeling, almost. But it's not the worst. Um, glazed sponge cake with cream filling and ap ap apricot? Apricot? One of those two fillings. Ooh, okay. This looks pretty. Oh, sorry. <clears throat> Hmm. I. Hmm. See, I'm a very, very sweet person, <laughs> so I enjoy sweet, sweet stuff. And that the sponge cake was kind of. Hmm. So, um. Next. Ooh, cookies with creamy nut filling and dark chocolate drizzle. Boom schizzle. <laughs> Guys, I don't know how to open this. Send help. <laughs> Send help. Okay. Oh. These are so cute. Oh my goodness. It's like I'm opening a present. my gosh that is beautiful oh dear <sighs> what in the world they're white and fluffy like mm, like meringues Mmm, mmm, mmm. Ooh. Mmm. Oh my gosh. That is so good. Dance party. Oh, oh, okay. Woo! Wow. That was good. Because of the fact it's just light and feathery. And you can't even, it's like you bite it. You bite it a second time, it's gone. But. You embraced the delicious flavor as it went onto your tongue and down your throat. Oh. Can I stop there? <laughs> no. Anyways. Um. Wow. I got like five more things. <laughs> that was so good. By far the best sweet thing I've had. This is my favorite non-sweet thing so far. Favorite sweet thing so far. And, um, <laughs> a milk chocolate bar with sweetened condensed milk filling. Boom skizzles. Let us try. Ooh, ooh, that chocolate looks shiny. Oh. <laughs> Ew. Oh, um, it tastes how I picture condensed milk to taste. Not a fan, not a fan. <laughs> mm -hmm. Um, oh, milk chocolate bar with salted peanut filling. Sorry, that was up and down. This looks promising. Ooh. Mm. 
I feel like that would be better with dark chocolate because of the fact that the salted peanut filling is not too salty and it's not sweet. So it's not like a Reese's. It's not like when you bite into the milk chocolate, the peanut butter is so salty and it brings out the sweet. It's like the peanut butter flavor is not really there. So I feel like dark chocolate would bring out the salt. That would, That's my opinion. All right. Chocolate covered gingerbread with apple... Apple-y. Is that a... apple A-P-P-L-I-E? Is that a word? Anyways, okay. Um... I'm scared. Oh! It smells like an apple pie, but... It's a heart. Happy Valentine's Day. <laughs> Anyways, it's shaped like a heart. Mm. Not my thing. Mm -mm. Not my thing whatsoever. But it's fine, you know? Alright. And. The last two things, and certainly not the least, is this, which is um, cream fudge, and this actually sounds really good. It's the most popular candy in Poland. Just three ingredients, cream, butter, and sugar, whisked until thick. So let us see how this tastes. This looks cool. My personal opinion, I feel like the butter overrides the other flavors, which I should have read this before. Our advice, take teeny tiny bits and let them melt in your mouth so the buttery sweetness lasts as long as it possibly can. Well, I wish I would have read that before. <laughs> now, it feels like I dunk sugar in my mouth and then bit into a butter stick. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> the next thing we're gonna try, and last thing, chocolate candies with strawberry and black currant fillings. I'm going to pick the strawberry. All right. Here we go. See, this really throws me off because this is like something that like a hard candy would come in, which yes, it's hard, but it has chocolate on the outside and that really throws me off. I didn't know if it was going to be like chocolate and then bam, like a jelly, but it's not. So I actually, I really did enjoy that. So that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this once again. Um, best, most definitely this. And I think a lot had to do with texture, which is why I really liked it. Um, second best is right here, Monster Munch, because I would actually like, I would love to eat this as just like a snack. Um, the worst, the only one I couldn't finish a whole thing of, these poppy seed thingamajiggies. Mmm, yeah, yeah, those were the worst. The weirdest, let me think. Eh. It's in between the, no, yeah. This one, because of texture for this one, but I really feel like this, um, the cream fudge was weird because at first I was like, texture is good, taste is good, and then after I started chewing it, all I tasted was butter, so that's why that would be the weirdest. 
Anyways, I hope you guys really enjoyed. I will try to post more, especially when, uh, since the other, Fe the February box should be headed out soon. And yeah, thanks for watching. Subscribe to my YouTube channel or don't. And bye, Felicia.